One man is dead, another injured following a shooting outside the Manaka Walmart yesterday. The man who died had stepped in to help the shooting victim. Now the family of that good Samaritan is demanding justice because they say a local police officer caused his death. Katie Kay's Shelley Bortz joins us live downtown after a news conference with the family's attorney. Shelley. 48 year old Kenneth Vineyard rushed to the side of a perfect stranger while he lied bleeding on the ground. And for that selfless act, he paid with his life. This appears to me to be another instance of senseless police violence. Attorney Joel Sansone stood behind this podium today speaking for a man who cannot. Kenneth Vineyard, seen here, tragically died last night for simply, Sansone says, helping someone he had never met. It was around 6.30 when gunfire erupted here in the parking lot of the Manaka Walmart, where police say 20-year-old Rashawn Smith was shot in the abdomen by Yeshua Bratcher. As the victim of that shooting lay bleeding, a good Samaritan named Kenneth Vineyard rushed to the victim to render aid. Once paramedics arrived, Sansone says Vineyard stepped away to allow them to do their job. Then a man in plain clothes demanded Vineyard step away from the victim. The 48-year-old tried to explain to the unidentified man that he was simply trying to help and make his way to his fiance who was nearby. The unidentified man insisted that Mr. Vineyard step away and violently pushed Mr. Vineyard to the ground where he struck his head on the pavement. Vineyard's fiance began chest compressions while first responders tended to him as he had no pulse. Vineyard was rushed to Beaver County Hospital where he later died from his injuries. I have come to learn that the unidentified individual who violently pushed Mr. Vineyard is a police officer employed by the Center Township Police Department. Sansone says there are many eyewitnesses, including Vineyard's own fiance, who saw the incident unfold. Furthermore, he says, video from the scene clearly shows that alleged violent shove by the officer. We want the name of the individual who caused this death, and we intend to sue him and possibly others. State police confirmed to KDKA earlier today that they are investigating that death. Meanwhile, Center Township police say they are handling the shooting investigation. Now, earlier today, state police announced, or excuse me, Center Township police announced charges against Bratcher. Reporting live in downtown Pittsburgh tonight, Shelley Bortz, KDKA News.